welcome to Ben Houston Botanical Garden. And here there are over a million lights, making this the most lights around Vancouver. And even more than the $60 ticket to Canyon Lights Suspension Bridge over in North Vancouver. And you can get there by taking the R441st Avenue Rapid Bus all the way to Oak Street. And after getting off the rapid bus, we're now doing our five minute walk over to Van Dusen Botanical Garden. It's not that far. <laughs> even light shows over here. The best thing about Fenders and Garden is that the lights here matches along with the music which is probably one of the few gardens that does it. Especially not Capitano Suspension Bridge. Not to roast them here but you know they're three times around the price but they don't do that. And that is Santa Owl. Who would have thought an owl is the Santa? <laughs> And just like that, we've walked through the magical tunnel here at Van Dusen Garden. I swear this is the best deal of Christmas lights that you can find here in Vancouver. 20 bucks or 21, something like that. And you get a million lights and also music that matches with it as well. And it's not even that crowded too, even when it's on full capacity on the website. My favorite part about all of this and especially going today is that a couple days ago it was snowing so there's still fresh snow on the ground and the whiteness in the picture making it better when we do photography as Winter Wonderland. And right behind us there, there are two gigantic snowmen for you to take pictures with as well. And FYI, yes, they are made out of styrofoam or concrete, but not snow for sure.
and we're now walking down the candy the, the candy cane lane with non-edible candy canes hanging off the trees. During the summertime, there's a lake here, but since it's so cold out here today, it's turned it turned into ice. Alright, Henry and I are now heading over to the food places to check out how the prices are here to buy food. Hopefully it's not too marked up because it's like 9.30 p.m. right now and even if we leave here, we, I don't even know if we can find a place outside to eat. Hopefully the prices are cheap. On our way over to the food area, there's also a winery here for you to drink wine as well if you're interested. And keep in note, it's 19 plus, so you need an ID with you. around 9.35, 9.40 p.m. and the park closes at 10 so we're now packing up in the freezing cold and we'll be going for food, finally. <laughs> so if you like the video, hit the like button, smash that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next adventure to another Christmas night show here in Vancouver. See you later.